This is Cindy Utter. Welcome to my arts endeavors. Have fun. Hey, 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 guys, guess what time it is? We have a large Marge in charge. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna randomly pick out an envelope. And here we go. This one came from Nana number three. Oh, I love this. I'm definitely gonna use that. Probably won't use it today, but I'm gonna use that. All right, let's see what we can bunch of junk here on my desk as usual um, let's see what we can pull together and oh, I think he's so cute let's have fun so let me just kind of get an idea what I'm gonna do here a little bit oh I like her let's use our fairy today we're gonna use our fairy today um, and give me a second we'll get I gotta get some scraps out that I'm gonna use and we're gonna make a page so we'll be right back all right, guys, so what I did is I pulled out some goodies, which I have right here from um, Nana number three's little stash that she sent to me. Let me bring it in a little bit. All right, I'm going to work on this page for one of two reasons. Number one, I love the colors, okay? I like the dream on there, and I just love this fairy. So she's gonna go on here. Also, number two, I wanna see how it's gonna be to work on something that's not quite exactly flat. So I figured let's do it because I've got a whole lot of them that I'm going to have to work with. So first thing I pulled out some of this homemade washi and I just absolutely love it. Um, basically what she's done is she's taken a piece of like acetate or this is actually like a plastic and put down masking tape and then just went to town playing with making marks. And it's phenomenal. So what I'm going to do... And I'm not getting a whole lot of stuff out today, you know, matte medium and all that. I'm just eh, not in the mood for that. So we're going to use the good old trusty glue stick. First, we're going to get some of this washi tape off. And let's give us a, some type of a border here. And like I said, in this journal, um, you're going to see a little bit of everything. You may see some collage you may see me just doodling on a page um a little bit of everything because that's what i want this journal to be i don't want a specific technique and that type of thing so we're this is a play journal and we are going to play my fingernails are not happy i have this little crack right there on the corner of that thumb where my skin is dry Oh my gosh never realized something that little could hurt as much as it does and of course you know every time I do something I have to hit my thumb it's like dang it but it is what it is and there goes my phone I'm sorry okay I like it we got a little let's throw a little bit up and down the sides here why not because we can, we can, we can. Um, so anyways, what was I saying? Uh, this journal, like I said, is going to be a little bit of everything. Why not? That's the fun part of it. And let's see. By the time you get this video, because I probably won't be able to do it until I get back, you guys will know by now that I have went to CHA. Um... I haven't actually went yet. I go tomorrow. I leave tomorrow. And I get to meet up with my dear, dear friend Gina. And I'm just so excited. We had a blast last time we got together. So we're expecting nothing but this time. And then throw into the mix Shin and Green. <laughs> and you know we're going to have fun. <laughs> so I'm really excited. I'm, I'm ready for adventures. And why not? So I'm, I'm, I'll be honest, I'm a little bit anxious. Whoops, I don't know what I just did. I just wound that tape up. I'm a little bit anxious about it as well, and that's because of the medical. Um, you know, sometimes I 
can't do as much as a lot of other people can. Most of the time, I should say, not sometimes. So, I'm, you know, I'm kind of worried about that. But, I mean, I know I have to do what I have to do to take care of my body. So, um, you know, if I'm not going to be able to make it out to do something, it, it, it's, it's okay. It's got to be okay. Because that's just the way it is. So, all right. We got us some little bit of washi. I love this washi. Very cool. All right. Now, what I was thinking, I have these, I pulled out this page also. What I want to do is I don't want this to be like straight. So I'm going to rip out, tear out some of these circles. Actually, let's go like this right down the middle of the page. And they don't have to be perfect. That's okay. I'm not looking for perfection here. And all these little bits and pieces um, will go in my little bits and pieces. And they'll be used on either ATCs, maybe on another page, who knows. Alright, so I've got three. I keep feeling some. I've got three of these. So what I'm going to do is use my trusty little glue stick here. And that glue top was not. My little glue stick. And I, I like to use an old phone book to glue on because then I don't get glue all over my desk and everything. So, so this one here. And put this one here. And this one. Okay. Now let's see what else we've got here. Right there. Um... Now, I love, like I said, I love, love, love this fairy. She's so beautiful. I think she's going to go just like this. Yeah, she's going to go just like that. Let's get her glued up. Glued up. Yeah, I found that this is the only use I could ever find for telephone books, is to use as a glue book, considering nobody, absolutely nobody, uses a telephone book anymore. If you do, I'm sorry. I'm not sure why you do. <laughs> Isn't she beautiful? Um, yeah, you just go online, Google it. Google knows everything. Google knows everything. Alright, we just glued her down there. Just making sure she's all good. Oops, see? Making sure she's all down. Now I also pulled out this little piece. I love this. Just glitter. So that's going to be put down here. But I also brought out some... Um, leaves and that kind of stuff. So I'm thinking this one's going to back. Something on this nature. Okay. So I can't glue on that. Hold on. Turn my page because I got lots of glue on that one. So let's turn my page. And I want that side up. So we're going to glue. Just want that there. Love it. Which side do I want? I want that side up. So we're going to go this side. Glue it. Right there. Get the glue off my hands. Just a little bit. Well, oh, these I'm going to save for another day. I love this little guy too. But you know what? I'm going to save him. He is so cool. Isn't he cool? <laughs> I love it. We're going to save that for another day. Okay. Now, I love this, so we're going to take a little bit of this. I 
I don't want to use all of it, but I do want to put some bling on here. Where can I? Hmm. I'm a thinking, I'm a thinking, I'm a thinking. I want to do some up this side. I don't, okay, we're going to do some up that side. We're just going to take a gander and cut it. Not sure why, but I'll do, I'll do that side or this side. Let's do this side. All right, and we're going to take some of my tacky glue. Glue stick won't do too well with this. Ah, so we're going to take my tacky glue. I'll make sure I'm not still in frame. Um, yeah, we're going to put it right through here. That's where it's going. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like I've told you guys before, I love this Aileen's Tacky Glue. They really need to find a different thing to put it in. Um, I have this little metal can I always keep it standing up in. Because if not, you have to sit there and wait patiently. And I have no patience. Alright, I think we've glued everything we're going to glue on her. I'm going to let this dry for a couple minutes so I don't move it off. And then we're going to do some doodling. And we'll be back. Alright, so what I did... I just let it dry quite a bit. Sorry, I got other crap going on over here. And now I'm just going to just play. This is my Stabilo pencil. And I have a water water um, pen right here. That's all it's in. This is just plain water. So you just take your Stabilo. And wherever you want to put any kind of a shadow or um, just pop something out a little bit. I'm trying to, I don't know, my mood is just kind of like, ugh, today. And I think it's because I know I have a long trip ahead of me tomorrow and it's going to be rough. So... I'm just trying to chill out today and really take it easy, not do a whole lot, um, because if I do, I'll just pay even more tomorrow, but it's going to be so worth it. I know it is, and I'm going to have a blast, And but it's just the knowing what else is coming along with it, you know? Isn't that cute? Um... I just, you know, I know there's going to be more pain, and I don't look forward to that, so. Let's take a white. This is the Posca. This is a, a cheaper brand. This is a Postilla, P-O-S-T-I-L-A. Um, this one was purchased at a uh, Japanese dollar store called Daiso, D-A-I-S-O, I believe is how you spell it. And this was only a buck fifty. So, and to be honest with you, it works just as well as the Posca. If not, a little bit better. This is more of an opaque paint. Posca has, um, it's, it's less opaque and it's a little bit um, denser or darker than that white. So, you know, depending on what you have or what you can afford, um, these are a great alternative. And I really like these paint pens. Okay. Now, I just want, I want some more sparkly on here. I've got this from Tattered Angels. Um, this is the Glam. It's the Glimmer Glitter Paint. And this one is Silver Diamonds. So I'm just going to take, not that brush, 
uh, not that brush, a small brush, and I've been shaking it, so I've got it shaken up. And I just want to add, come here, brush. I want to add some glitter. Glitter. So all I'm doing is just adding a little bit of glitter. You can't really see it from there. But when I, when I hold it up, you'll be able to. I just want the whole thing to glitter. It's so beautiful. Let me just, I notice I like this paint and see, you can see the glitter in there, but I notice, um, of course it's gonna, I notice the glitter tends to settle a lot quicker. I don't like that, but we're just going to add some glitter here and there just to give her some more sparkle. Glitter's good. Let's put some more on her wings. I have to be careful because I'm not sure what um, Marianne has used for uh, pens or colors to color this. And there is a good possibility that it could be um, water-based. So I just have to be careful. When you do, just a heads up, when you do get, um, ooh, that one wasn't dry. When you do get happy mail from people, um, just understand that depending on what they do, there is a possibility that it may not um, work the way you would expect depending on what they used in there to make the art. So that was just, wow, a long, <laughs> a long sentence for <laughs> a short message. Oh, yay, yay. <laughs> it's my day, I'm telling you. All right. Uh, let me put that down. Okay, I'm going to dry this real quick, and then I'm going to go back in with that white. I don't know if you can see. can't really see the glitter, can you? A little bit. You see it's glossy, but there's actually glitter there. So, all right, give me a second. I'll be right back. All right, so I think this is pretty well dry. Now I'm going to go back in. This is with the um, no-name brand one. And just redo my dots that I decided to go over and they were still wet and I'm gonna redo the Posca dots because they are not as bright as the other ones and do a few more Just something I love about dots. They're very, what is it, meditative <laughs> to do. Fun, fun, fun. Love it. All right, I don't think I'm going to do much more to her. She's got Dream. She's a beautiful, beautiful fairy. Marianne, thank you so, so much. I hope you like your page. I think she's absolutely beautiful. So, Thanks so much, guys, for watching. We'll see you again soon. Bye. Hey, everybody. I hope you enjoyed that video. As always, hit like, share, comment. I'll answer any of the comments that you have or questions. Um, and as always, be kind, have fun. That's what life's all about. And happy creating. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.